hull breacher. Right? How do I highlight? This is two picks, right? So that gets reserved. So if I click it, it reserves it. Okay. And then you submit. Okay. I, it's been, I don't think I've ever used this new draft interface. So I don't think it's particularly close. Well, I guess you could theoretically take time walk over hull breacher. But I don't know. I've, I mean, from everything I've seen about hull breacher, it looks insane in this format. And time walk is like, it can be pretty hit or miss in cube sometimes. That's my experience. That could be completely wrong, by the way. I, I, I'm leaning towards Ruby Holbreacher, and I'm not 100% sure that's correct. But imagine taking a questing beast. Imagine ever drafting a questing beast. So I think Ruby Holbreacher, I mean, I could definitely see it being Ruby Time Walk, but I think Ruby Holbreacher seems reasonable to me. So I'm going to try that. All right, here we've got Simic Signet. Uh, I'm a big fan of Glenelend. Oh, whoa, 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 how do I? Wait, wait, why did it, why did it auto pick it for me? I thought that was reserving it. Is that not reserving it? What am I doing, chat? I double clicked. Okay, well. We've got a Glenelendra, which is fine. I'm okay with a Glenelendra. I think I'm just going to take Glenelendra Simic Signet. I'm not sure how good Top is. I'm sure Top is, like, pretty reasonable, though. Um. Oh, I forgot to do the shout-out thing in the beginning when we made it. Uh, oh, well. Because I'm going to make it a YouTube video. Okay, that. Uh, is Top better than a Simic Signet? I could see it being better than a Signum Simic Signum. We'll take top. Oh, we got a Sapphire. All right, I'll take a Sapphire. Even Skydiver is actually probably fairly reasonable in this format. Um, I mean, I, I don't really think there's any really reason to take a Fatty early. I kind of am leaning towards like a Mox and a Skydiver. I don't know. This card is like almost playable in vintage. It's probably even better in this format where everyone is just mono drafting Moxon. Yeah, let's try it. Let's try it. I'm in. All right, here we've got a Lotus Petal, Expansion Explosion, Treasure Cruise. You guys can't see something? Oh, shit. You're right. This is why I don't draft. Can I like push something? Okay, what about, what about now? Does that help? That probably helps. Magic put something. What is over on this side? Oh my god, there's so many options. What is normally? Is that sideboard? All right, all right, all right. So you guys are good now, right? You can see ship. <laughs> Scuffed streamer has no idea how to play formats that are not vintage. And this is like way in my face, and I don't want it to be way in my face. All right, all right, we're back. Um, I don't know. I've, I, I'm pretty in on Lotus Petal. Because uh, I don't really think we're playing fair games of magic here. I'm kind of like thinking about expansion explosion. What's this do? Copy instant or sorcery. Yeah, that seems lit. I don't know how easy it is for me to cruise. That's my that's my problem. I have no idea how easy it is to cruise. Let's just go with expansion explosion. I'm in. All right. Uh, this the hand looks quite weaker. I think I want this misty rainforest and remand. I guess I'm a pretty big thousand year storm fan. Uh, but I don't really think we're really thousand years storming currently. I feel like we just want to have like a mind's desire and then just a bunch of fair blue cards or something. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure where we're going with it currently. We just have fast mana and, and broken blue cards, which is probably the place to be anyways. I think we should do this. Okay. Another Sapphire. I'm in on more Sapphires. So here we've got Sapphire Drain, Sapphire Metamorph, Sapphire Monolith. 
thinking Sapphire. It's either Drain or Metamorph. I just don't know which one it is. I feel like there's a possibility that Drain is like quite good in this cube, especially when we're on double Sapphire. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. I'm sold. You got me, chat. All right, where are we at? We're at Upheaval, Factor Fiction, Grand Dynamo. Oh, sorry. I hit you away. I think Drain makes a lot of sense. Grand Dynamo is a good thing to play with our Drain mana. So is Factor Fiction. I guess so is Upheaval, theoretically. Maybe not. I don't know how good Upheaval is in this cube. It feels like Upheaval wouldn't be as good in this cube. So, like, because everyone's on Moxin, right? But what if instead we are like Factor Fiction Thran Dynamo? That's kind of where I think I want to be. Yeah. All right. All right. My my basic my basic magic intuition is is correct. Compa uh, not compared to chat, but according to chat. Yeah. I'm in. I'm in. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right. We got another jet. Not another jet. Just another mox. And uh. We've got Time Spiral, Fetchable Breeding Pool, Force of Negation is probably super important in this cube. Uh, I guess we're just picking Mox Negation. Yeah, that makes sense to me. All right, I feel like we need to do something. <laughs> I feel like our deck doesn't do anything, but maybe that's fine. Maybe it's okay. Uh, all right, I'm looking at like a Snappy Boy, maybe an Emery. Uh... Through the Breach is a reasonable Magic the Gathering card. Currently, I don't know how I... I mean, it gives us something to do, which is not a bad thing. I don't... Yeah. Normally, I'd be like... Maybe we could play, like, Warren Power Stone and try to find a Tinker or something, but... Maybe we just want Snap Through the Breach, and that way we have a plan. I don't hate that. All the other picks are kind of medium. Like, Emery's pretty good. Metamorph is pro I mean, Metamorph gives us a plan, right? We just copy their thing, and then uh, we don't have any ways to deal with their thing, though. All right, I'm, I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm in on Snap Metamorph. You sold me, champ. Seems reasonable here. Oh, Sphinx. That's a good one. I like that one. I feel like I might draw my whole deck if I do that, but... Uh, definitely, I'm thinking, like, Sphinx Watery Grave, maybe? I guess... This technically kind of, I mean, Sphinx Freeze, Sphinx Fire and Ice is also probably reasonable. Sneak Attack is pretty good, too. Yeah. I feel like we just can probably, you think Sphinx is medium? Whoa. Oh. I think I can get down with Sphinx Brain Freeze here. I guess there's also, like, Zealous Conscripts, Sneak Attack. I mean, at some point, we have to draft ways to win, right? Six mana doesn't sound that rough. We're playing Mana Drain and, like, 10, 10 Moxen or something insane. I kind of... Maybe we don't actually need a Sphinx. Maybe we're Brain Freeze, Fire Ice. <laughs> what about that? What if we do that? We have... This, is, this deck does nothing. Uh... All right, uh, I'm. I, I, what about like another like a? I, I don't even know if we need. We didn't take the thousand year storm. If we had taken the thousand year storm, I wish we had taken the thousand year storm. Actually, all right, I'm kind of in on this though. This sounds fine. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we should take a a a, a, a black fetch land in case we want to like splash a black card. Not a, It's not a fetch land. It's a card to get off a of fetch land, but. Brain Freeze is unplayable. I can't imagine that would be true. Is Prismatic Vista really better than Watery Grave, though? Like, if we get this, we can go for, like, Brain Freeze Ashiok, right? You want me to go fire and ice watery? I'm going to fire and ice watery grave. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Here's our win con. We found a win con. We found a win con. <laughs> it wouldn't be a Justin stream if we weren't playing. 
<laughs> artifacts and pyroblastable creatures. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. All right, mono blue Urza. We 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 strayed we strayed not very far from the tree. No pyroblast in the cube. Oh, it, this is it's game over. There's no pyroblast. How can I ever lose? See, Rodney, I, I think Brain Feast was probably fine, but people were telling me it wasn't, so I I, I caved, and I, you know, I, I don't know. It's fine. Oh, I'm okay with it. There's no Pyroblast? All right, snap it off. Ooh, what is this pack? You should get hit Lotus Ancestral? I wish I could have this Karn so that I could have more Urza stuff, but... I mean, Lotus Ancestral, we can't complain. I guess we can complain that we lose our jet, right? <laughs> Turn one Urza, baby. <laughs> I guess we kind of want more mana drains now, actually. All right, here we have negation plus vamp, maybe. Or, or Oko. Oko is probably pretty good. People are somewhere between Oko, Negation, and Thoughtseize. No one thinks Vamp? Okay, all right. Noted, noted. Yeah, currently we have mostly mana. <laughs> our, de our deck is currently mostly mana. This is a fair, this is a fair point. I think I'm, I'm leaning towards Negation Oko. I know I don't have any green yet, but we can, how many pack, how many picks do I have left? How do I tell? Uh, 15 cards of, uh, select uh, five more picks, 10 more cards. All right, I'm, I'm leaning towards Oko because that at least will help us answer things. I'm, I'm, I'm down. I'm down. All right, so here we can, we can get that brain freeze that we never had. Oh, what about Talarian Academy Venser though? What about Talarian Academy Venser though? God, this is this is a very Justin deck. This is a peak Justin deck. I'm picking a Talarian Venser. You can't stop me. It doesn't matter. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, so another Fetch Land, another Oko, a Mole Drifter. Um, I mean, we still don't have any ways to splash the Oko yet, though. That's my worry. We have how many more picks? Like six more picks. We need to find like a tropical island or something. I guess technically. I don't want to play like any forest in my deck though. I want to play like all islands. I don't want to play any forest if possible. You know what I'm saying? Is it worth it to pick up Preordain here? Or can I just go like Oko Flooded Strand? Your name's for losers. I'm just thinking, like, if I can find a tropical island and I just have a bunch of fetches and I just don't have to play any forests. I think uh, I'm, I'm off this. I'm off this. I think Moldrift. Look how much mana I have. Moldrifter's got to be good. Moldrifter's got to be better than Preordain in this deck. I still don't think we can take second Oko without colored sources. I'm going to go Moldrifter after Flooded Strand. All right, so I picked up Time Walk. Moldrifter unplayable? What world are you living in? I can hard cast it off my mana drain mana. Uh, all right. I want a negation. How many negations am I at? I'm at three negations. That's a lot of negations. I'm thinking time walk now. I'm thinking, t man, I don't want to lose this this over this ruby for no reason though. Can I like? This isn't the best time walk deck. I'm not gonna lie to you. It's probably it's probably fine though. I think I want time walk. Ah, uh, man. Do I want ruby negation or? S I feel like we just want time walk negation, right? I, re I feel like we don't need a ruby. 
at this point in our lives. I feel like is that is that where that's where we're at. All right, hold on. This is my second. Al- oh, a Narsa, a Narsa, uh, definitely a Narsa, definitely a Narsa. How do we win again? Oh, we have an Urza. Okay, definitely picking a Narsa here. Definitely want a Narsa. I guess we can just take this Delta, but we still don't really have anything to fetch with it. <laughs> we still just have one watery grave and no black cards. <laughs> uh, I guess we just take repeal then. All right, I would take repeal, whatever. It's my last pack. I got Demonic Tutor. All right, look at that. Look at that. The, the, the watery grave is coming in clutch. We, we found Demonic Tutor. Wonderful. <laughs> uh, shit. All right. We have Demonic Tutor and we have. Bro, I don't know. Uh, Why do I need a Vista? I'm not playing any. No- I'm not playing cards of a different color. We're playing Mono Blue Splash Demonic Tutor off Watery Grave. <laughs> I'm not playing. I just won't play the Oko. <laughs> I'm just I can tell you this deck is playing zero forests. You're 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 not let, I'm not putting a forest in this deck. Ulamog is castable. It might be reasonable to have an Ulamog, but if we put an Ulamog in our deck, it does give our opponents bribery targets. That's a worry of mine. That is a, that's a currently that's currently a worry of mine. I kind of think like our deck's actually pretty decent at brainstorming, right? We have Two fetches. <laughs> we can beat an Urza. We've got a repeal in our deck. Shit, no. I, yeah, we've got a repeal in our deck. Urza's no problem. I think I'm taking Brainstorm Demonic Tutor. I could see days. I could see days. I feel like we have so many bad cards that we want to brainstorm, though. <laughs> I feel like we have like 8 million mana sources in our deck. Maybe the game plan is just like Skydive or Solemn Simulacrums. I think that's the game plan. It's either Demonic Days or Demonic Brainstorm, I think. Or pretty good Days deck, not going to lie to you. We don't have that many fetches. Oh, we don't have any more cards. This is this is this is the last. All right, I'm gonna go demonic demonic days. There, this is the last cards. Yeah, yeah. I don't I don't know if our deck is winning games, but uh, <laughs> yes. That's true. We might not actually have many 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 islands to days. All right, so this is like. Twenty-five. Uh, normally, what is it? Uh, how many? Oh, I think that's an easy cut. I agree. How many cards do I need to cut, though? So this would be sixteen mana sources. All right. Perfect. Great deck building chat. I like it. Oh, we're not cutting expansion explosion. That's probably the only way we're winning the game. <laughs> ah, it's beautiful. I don't. Yeah, our deck doesn't do very much, uh, but hopefully it's going to be good enough. Uh, did I ever tweet that I was live? I did. Fantastic. Beautiful. Wonderful. So what do you guys think, chat? Is this a 1-2? This is a 1-2 deck? All right.
That's true. Opponents could just concede. This deck does nothing. Yeah, but my opponents will also do nothing very powerful. That's the idea, yes? Maybe? I don't know. Could not be the idea. Who knows? Uh, anyways, all right. Yo, this deck needs... No, it doesn't. What am I talking about? All right. Save. This deck is viable? Deck is viable? All right, that's, that's good enough for me. That is good enough for me. What the hell happened in here? Yo, Discord is a wild place. Discord is a wild place. Bro, the, the bot put me on cooldown. Is this real life? Uh, how's a bot just going to put me on cooldown like that? All right, all right. We did this. We did this thing. Stuff. Uh, all right, all right, all right. So... Mono blue Urza as intended by by Justin. It could never have been anything else. This deck would destroy Vintage PO. It would absolutely destroy every deck kind of destroys Vintage PO to be honest, but we don't talk about that anymore. Turn one Lotus Demonic Thalia. Is that a play? I don't hate it. I used to hate Thalia, but now... I don't know. I kind of like it. Yo, how are you casting your Oko, though? <laughs> I, I refuse to put a Forest in my deck, so I would like to know how you'd like to cast the Oko off of just Emerald Petal Lotus. Maybe that's enough. I, I could be enough. No, we just... The, see, my problem is, we have a Metamorph to copy a threat and win, but I have no way to beat a Resolve threat. <laughs> Resources is plenty. All right, all right, all right, we can put the Oko in. I just won't put a forest in. What do you want to take out? We can play the Oko. I'm just, I will, I will not put a forest in. <laughs> I'm not putting a forest in this deck. Fire ice? Y'all hating on fire ice? I'm not adding a forest. It's just not happening. <laughs> it's not happening. This deck would hate to have a forest in it. I'm not... Uh, expansion Explosion looks lit here. The expansion part. Days feels weak. Yo, everyone's got some conflicting ideas. Is this what Twitch chat is like? No, we need repeal. Repeal is very important. Yeah, I don't know, man. I think you all disrespect Fire and Ice right now. We're playing with the deck as originally intended. I will not I will not fall to the peer pressure from the trap. I will not I will not fall to this peer pressure. We should have to find a, an opponent though. Doesn't seem like there are opponents left. Look at this it's beautiful. I mean, it doesn't actually look that good. I don't know. It doesn't actually. It's not very. It's not very pretty, but 
It tastes fantastic. So much disrespect for fire and ice. It's got to be the Zoomers. It's got to be the Zoomers. I'm not a big cube guy. I'd rather just brew decks and play them in vintage. I don't know. All right, we found an opponent. It is time. It's time to put all of our hard work to the test. I'm hoping for one win. I'm not going to lie to you. All right. And the borders look good. All right, I think we're good to go here. Round one, Vintage Supreme Cube. We've got a deck that does a whole lot of nothing, but it looks real nice. I made, I made on this. Keep. I like this deck. I'm in. Beautiful. Is there a Mind Break Trap? Anyone, anyone know? I get a, can I get a Mind Break Trap reading? No Mind Break Trap? That's my format right there. Yo, that's cool. MTG bot does that. That's lit. Hey, it's a hideaway. Wow, that card's pretty good and limited, huh? Yeah, that's a problem. Let's just put it right into play. You may play without paying it. Jeez. All right. Well, that could be a problem. I kind of need their spells to go on the stack. Oh, it goes on the stack? Okay, then, then we're fine. Yo, this is, this is great. A plus w would play Foff again. Though I feel like we can't play Foff on our turn, right? I feel like this is a force negation format. I feel like we can't be doing Foffs on, on our turn. I probably should have ordered that differently, but whatever. I got a hole breacher. That should be pretty good. So, yeah. I mean, I guess I... One, two, three, four, five, six. So, I don't even have enough to... See, if I had put the... If I had put the sapphire underneath the top, then I could have put the sapphire into play, and that would have given me six mana. No. That should still be six mana. Oh, I'm at five mana right now. Duh. All right. I feel like there's no way we're ever going to be casting this FOF into Force of Negation. So, you guys think I'm supposed to cast it into Force? I can't. I can't imagine that would be true. Though I guess they're going to have like no preordains or anything. I don't know. I feel like holding up my own hard cast negation is pretty important as well. Could be wrong. Alright, so now that would be playing into all of their counter magic. I guess we just don't have to cast it, right? Now we have counter magic back up. Lotus Petal lets me demonic tutor too. I feel like I misordered again. 
How is it I've misordered every single divining top? It's okay. Once the factor fiction resolves, the order doesn't matter. <laughs> Got him. I'd love some treasures. That'd be dope. What do you got? What do you got for me? Whoa there, Brendo. Huh. I have to cast my factor fiction now, don't I? Because I only have all my blue mana off of this thing. All right. Uh. Okay. All right. Okay. I feel like we're gonna get a nice pile for this too, because they don't want to give us a force of negation. I feel like we're gonna get some some serious value off of this fa. Maybe our deck is lit, actually. Put one pile into your hand. Okay. Island or... Uh. I feel like we're just... I mean, the thing is, if we counter this, they don't get a 3-1. That's my thing, you know? Do we rather have another force? Probably. You said there's no force of will, right? Just force of negation? So I can just recast this whole Reacher right now? This thing can't even block, right? All right maybe it doesn't actually matter. Oh, there is force of will. All right, I'm just going to... I'm going to force this. I think it's kind of a free roll. I guess we don't have we don't know that we have a blue card for our top. I guess that's a problem. Whatever. Because they could like, I don't know, tinker or something. Eh, I don't really know. It seems like a pretty reasonable value. I mean, I guess they could just go Ruby Tinker, right? And then we look silly. No, Oko's not in our deck. <laughs> oh, Oko's not in our deck. <laughs> All right, maybe we should put Oko in our deck. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, I can't attack with my whole breacher anymore, but I feel like we're winning. <laughs> okay, once we get the mold drifter going, that's that's when you know. Oh hell yeah! Oh hell yeah! Why? Because we don't want to play into force of will, and we wanted to counter their threat. All right, should we get Glenelendra? I don't know. Glenelendra seems sick. Moldrifter seems good. Skydiver seems fine. Urza doesn't really do that much. It's okay, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's actually just strictly worse not talking at two times speed. One, two, three, four. I guess we can get Urza. I don't know, Glenelendra seems nutty. Urza gives us some more spells that we can use, but none of our, none of, we don't have, like, the greatest hits off of it. I mean, they're not terrible, but I feel like there's a lot of misses on our Urza. Uh, Narset's kind of garbage against an army of goblins, so kind of off that life. We get a Glenelendra. I'm getting a Glenelendra. You can't stop me. The downside of Glenelendra is... I do have to probably just tap out for this, but whatever. 
Yeah, but then I, yeah, but then she still dies. If I have a Glenelindra, how can I possibly lose? You know what I'm saying? Like, I have infinite counter magic, except for creatures. And this attacks for lethal in seven turns. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think Glenelindra makes the most sense there. Look how much counter magic I have. How is the opponent going to play, play the game? That attack was loose? Why? Why did that attack loose? We're not going to get clocked by this. I mean, we might we might have been clocked by that. Can't counter the shell dock. Someone told me this goes on the stack. What do you mean can't counter the shell dock? Unless it's a creature. We have it. We have fire and ice. Not the other one. I should have floated. Whoops. Whoops. Uh, just draw the Narset normally, guys. Come on now. Though this does probably just find the top. I, w I really just want to clear my top cards, anyways. So. No, Mr. Urza. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. All right, now I don't think I'm going to attack because I would. If they want to attack all their things in and we get to eat two of them, then I'm cool with that. Now I can reman their thing off of Shell Dock Isle, though. I feel like we're going to win this game. I feel like we got. We have complete control. Feeling good. I guess I should have probably leave open, like, it's probably not the best way to tap my mana. Seeing as now I have to, like, I can't counter, like, a spell in each turn or whatever, or each uh, phase. I don't know. All right, they're playing something. If it's a creature, we have to remand. If it's not, we have Glenelendra still, so... Uh, that resolves. Because I haven't, well, I'm going to lose my Narset. Maybe we just want to, what do we want to do? What do I want to do? What do I want to do? Oh, I have a Breacher, too. Yeah, all right, that just resolves. <laughs> I have two, I have two broken cards. Do it, attack my Narset, you won't. I mean, they probably should. All right, Narset down. Now I win the race, though. Now I very much win the race. What is happening? Oh, I have 20 or fewer cards. Okay. What is this? I didn't... <laughs> it's either player. Oh, look at the play! That's so good. Uh, hmm. So I can reman this. Just so I de deal extra damage this turn. Or I could just counter it with Glenelendra. Uh, uh, I feel like this is a perfectly reasonable spot to use their reman, though. Oh, what if I had looked at my top? I could have dazed that shit. I should have looked at my top first. Oh, just miss. Okay, it's okay. It's fine. Everything's everything's fine. Everything's everything's daijobu. Everything's daijobu. We can't lose this game. Our deck is unbeatable. We're basically playing better Delver because our Delvers are hull breacher.
I can also expansion explosion. I have infinite counter magic. How is opponent ever going to win the game? There's nothing even worth expansion and explosioning, right? This does nothing because I just I get I get <laughs> I just get a treasure from that. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. You may concede now. You may shame concede now. A, a player can concede at any time. It's now your time. All right. It's apparently not their time. Attack all? Your monster? This is not a race you're winning? Um. Why don't we have an Urza in play? We never drew it. It doesn't get it doesn't get taken off a of Narset. Uh deals X damage to any can I just kill my opponent here? Oh, I need to counter their abrade first. Wait, maybe I don't. How much man how much damage does this do? This is X. So blue, blue, red, red, one. Oh yeah, I just kill them with this, right? <laughs> well, I draw cards. Huh. Boom, headshot. This deck's perfect. I love it. <laughs> Wait, maybe this format is fantastic. Mm. <laughs> At least Hall Breacher is good somewhere. <laughs> Thanks, Dan. Powerful wizard. I think I would rather just get rid of this piece. Even though I can't cast my Narset, if I get rid of this piece, I'm more likely to Muldrafter anyways, I think. This hand is perfect. I've never seen a more perfect hand. You got it, homie. Imagine playing more than just blue in your deck. Imagine playing more than just blue mana in your deck. Wouldn't be me. Divination, please. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right. Never mind. This format's perfect. I love every minute of it. <laughs> Maybe we'll just do this all day. This was the last day of this format. Shit. What have I done doing? <coughs> Excuse me. Ah, uh, uh, I have made a mistake. I haven't been playing this the entire week. <laughs> uh. Wait a second. Is this winning? I just I just had some prosciutto go down the wrong way. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is this the mythical double ancestral? Where I can't counter this spell?
Oh, double mana morphos. Okay. That's good. All right. I see you, opponent. Nice. I like that. This card is awesome. I'm a big fan of this card. I like it a lot. We played uh we played four of these in our Lurin deck. For better or for worse. I mean, yeah, some goblins here is a problem for sure, but I don't think I'm supposed to like negation one of the mana or anything. <laughs> They're gonna return this the Stormgate. Oh man, our opponent uh is like, oh, they're going to return my island. Sure. Yeah, don't give a shit. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> you got to. Actually, that is two creatures that I have to deal with. I don't know if I can, I don't know if I can battle that. So, we now have Mana Drain Mana and Foth Mana. Uh, I think I'm just going to pass. I added Oko. That's fair. Oko is probably quite good in our deck. We should probably just have it at all times. Uh, I just have to draw the emerald every time. All right, I'm not gonna do anything here. I'll I have some life to use as a resource. Uh, I'm not bouncing either of those creatures. I can tell you that much. What is this? Is this gonna be? Oh, please play a jar. Please play a jar. Please play a jar. Give me a jar. All right, that works too. I would love for that to turn into four colorless mana, please. God, this is, this is, this is, oh, this is fantastic, chat. This is just, this is beautiful. Yeah, we do. We just counter the tinker. Easy game. Oh, oh, look at this deck. What have I been doing? This is perfect. This thing blocks twice. This is a, this is absurd. This is I think our deck is perfect actually. Our deck has never never failed us. I'm just gonna play a Glenalendra. Should I play this Narset too? Or should I just hold up all the Glenalendra stuff? Mm, hold up hardcast negation. Yeah, I'm gonna hold everything up. We got time. Opponent doesn't beat down very fast. Our deck is perfect. I love it. I love it. Wait, I'm actually having fun. People told me this format was bad. Maybe next match. Maybe maybe it's just... I think I'm going to block here. A little weird, but... I can Venser back my Glenelendra. Oh! That's just value. This game's over! Ah, uh, chat. I don't know, man. Ooh, this is... This is... This is this is too good. What is this? Are they gonna abrade it? Oh my god! Oh my! Oh my god! The value! The value! The, the value! <laughs> yes. Oh uh, yeah. I mean. This is just this is this is just good clean living. Dude, it's a beautiful thing. Oh my lord. They can never win. <laughs> they can never win. Uh... Yeah, the Oko should probably be in the deck, let's be honest here. Let's be honest. What are we taking out for it though? Maybe this daisy is garbage. <laughs> There's no fire blast. Can't possibly lose. Oh my lord! How? Oh, 
just gets better. Every time it just gets better and better and better. Just keeps getting better. I, I, just, I want to hold this so they can cast a spell and try to draw cards. <laughs> I need that in my life. <laughs> uh, I, this could beat us. They could have like um, an Ember Cool or something, right? I don't. I don't know. Theoretically. Oh, my Lord. It's just, it's just beautiful. It's just. All right. All right. I hope every game just goes like that. Who needs win cons when you can just manage range shit? Oh, no, I'm turning into chains. I'm turning into chains. <laughs> oh, there's only one day left. Incredible. Incredible. I think I want a beer, actually. That's why. Oh, at Oko, at Oko. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Cancel, cancel. How do I do that? Edit deck. All right, Days is gone. Oko is in. Save deck. Play. We're not adding a forest. Oh, look at that. Instant Q as well. This hand looks reasonable. This Lotus Petal looks kind of bad, too. But, um... Um, I mean, this seems fine. All right, island. Makes sense. I feel like they're going to cast Ancestral on my upkeep here. Nope, no Ancestral on my upkeep. All right. I guess we have hard cast negation now. Our jet got negationed? Are you wilding, opponent? Opponent's wilding, chap. Opponent just two for one my jet. And then we're casting something? And now we're in casting? What? How we didn't how did we not cast this in my upkeep? Our opponent, we gotta teach opponent how to play some vintage, you know? I mean, you got me. Yo, what is up, Rafa? We're playing peak vintage right now. I guess. Uh, if you saw our game one, you would have loved it. Or our round one. If you if you ever if you go back and watch the round one, it's like it's very Raphael magic. We got extreme value. Our Vencer did work. Don't even blow my mind every night. What the heck? All right, this player's got a couple ancestral recall. I see this now. Why don't they just play this on my turn again? I don't, I mean, opponent's deck looks good. I just don't like the timing that opponent keeps using. Force of will, pitching impulse. Right? Uh, I guess it's Glenelendra, seeing as I'm probably not going to be able to cast it for a little while. 
Opponents like got our deck, but better, it looks like. Two ancestral recalls. I guess if we draw Lotus, we wanted to keep that Glenelandra. Oh, that's a good one. I want that in play, but. I guess opponent missed their land drop there, right? So I think I'm just gonna, gonna fire, uh, ice them. All right, okay. All right, we just need that land. Moxon? Lotus? Sure. Why not? Um... If we wait for another land, we can have negation up. Eh, it's probably not good. Ancestral? Time walk. Remand. Wow. All right, so we had four hits on our, our, our NAR set here. It's got to be time walk, right? We could have we could have cast we could have cast Metamorph. It's true. We chose not to. All right, I'm gonna take Time Walk. I think. No copying Narsa. If only. Yo, what's up, Tim Grant? Okay, Moxin off of this. Perfect. Just how we drew it up. I think the game has been won. Yeah, yeah, okay. Sure. I think I'm still metamorphing a hold reacher here though. They kill our hold breacher in response, we'll just make it a sapphire. Alright. Our opponent really can't draw cards. Or raw. Okay. Land? Moxon? Snapcaster Mage. I feel like I'm still supposed to attack for six, even though we'll like lose our Narset. We have double hole Richard. We don't really care about Narset. Six is a lot. We almost have Snap Walk as well. So. Alright, they hit the red mana. Narset's gonna die. Maybe not. Maybe Narsa doesn't die. Is balance in this format? Anyone got a got a exclamation mark? Is balance in this format? Mm, balance is in this format. All right. If we can hit snap walk here, okay. Uh, it's just a braid or something. Uh, yeah. Your mana has been morphed. I get a treasure. I appreciate that. <laughs> Shame concede. Shame concede. Shame concede. Oh, there's a lightning bolt. Um. Let's see. If I do snap walk... Then they're at seven and they go to two. Uh, hmm. I know that I can full pay force of negation. I just don't know if I want to, you know? Is there Dovin's veto? Is that why they made white mana? I'm going to counter it. I don't think I need to counter it. All right, they have their own counter magic. They have Foth. 
Fair. Uh, I guess we just... Give them all of the mana. All right, they got a bunch of mana. I guess they could, uh, I don't know, empty the warrens or something now. Oh, we could lose, I guess. I think I wasn't supposed to counter that, but whatever. Desire? No, they would have played Mana Crypt, right? Oh, bribery. <laughs> They're getting a Mole Drifter, baby. Our deck is bribery proof. <laughs> we got all of our creatures. Oh, Venser's good one. Yeah, I guess they can get Venser. That's true. That's true. Our deck is still pretty bribery proof. Oof. Oof. Venser's a good one. I'm glad we countered Bolt then, or they could draw cards. They still have a Mana Crypt and a Fetch Land in their hand, right? No, they have a Mana Crypt and a Watery Grave and one Unknown. Oh, they got Mole Drifter. Ah, oh, sorry, friend. <laughs> thank you for your <laughs> thank you for your donation. <laughs> your treasure, your treasure is much appreciated. Oh my lord! Wait, this format is perfect. What am I? What was I thinking? This format is perfect. This format is perfect. Oh my lord. Wait, chat. What this This format is actually just the best. Why did everyone say this format was garbage? Everyone on Twitter told me this format was terrible. Oh yeah, we're living the high life. That's for sure. We're drinking champagne of beer at the moment. <laughs> this is the perfect format. I should have known better. Twitter has led me astray. Twitter has led me astray. I mean, we don't have any negations, so we could get wrecked here. Okay, are they tapped out? They're tapped out. They did have a bunch of fours. They're at two cards in hand. We're definitely supposed to just go like time walk breach here, right? That's got to be better, right? Then just casting like ancestral or something. I guess I shouldn't play into daze. Oh well. I guess if they daze this, then I have ancestral. I feel like I feel like we're definitely going time walk here. High life is the perfect stream beer because it's just bread. Did we just draw a Moxon? Our deck is unbeatable. <laughs> Our deck is perfect. If only we had a tropical island, honestly. If our deck had a tropical island, probably perfect. All right, whatever. I'm going to fucking cast this shit. Nah, I, I, I saw the opening. I saw the opening for the Ancestral. It was time. I want more. <laughs> I was just about to say. I want more blue mana. Ask and you shall receive. All right, opponent. You're allowed to concede. <laughs> you are allowed to concede the match. <laughs> this deck is perfect. <laughs> Uh, wait a second. Wait a second. Yeah, yeah, that's what. <laughs> yeah, this deck is great. This deck is perfect. All right, 
GG's Mr. or sorry, GG's opponent. Tigarumio. Tigarumio. I don't know. Whatever. Run it back. Uh never mind. This deck is perfect. I can't believe I have exactly one day left of playing this format. What have I done? What have I done? Maybe this is the perfect opportunity, right? If we can just 3 0, 6 0, and just leave on top, you know? We did the thing. It was great. Never again. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one. No, don't thought seize me. Not as bad. Rip Black Lotus. Moxon, Moxon, Moxon. Oh, never lucky. Yeah, but why not ask for more? How much do I? Oh, I'm going to be one mana short, aren't I? I'm one mana short of the hard cast negation. I guess I can spin, I guess. Spin. Yeah, I mean, this is exactly what I like to do in magic. <laughs> this is actually just exactly what I like to do in ma okay alright I see you opponent you don't like me having spells see that now uh, spin my boy at the top what do you got for me top oh 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 I see yeah this this is the best fucking format <laughs> this is just everything I ever want to do in the same deck. It's perfect. <laughs> it's, yes, it's perfect. <laughs> How I, um, wow. I was misled. I was lied to. That's true. We don't have Tinker Bolas in it out. That's fair. This is pretty nice though. I was I was I was extremely misled. I thought this was a one two deck. Chat chat was talking to me like I drafted a one two deck. This is a this is a this is a, a masterpiece. Humans may never see a deck like this again. Look at this perfect piece of deck building. Cop. Uh, wait a second. Wait a second. Uh, yeah, what if I time walk twice, though? No, 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 no. It's got to be this. Uh, I guess this hand is a little weak to the Thought Seize Duress deck. I didn't think that through. Who cares? Whatever. Snap it off. Yeah, yeah. So they high rolled. We didn't even high roll. We just had a, a normal roll. I don't know if that's actually true. The other hand wasn't bad? Yeah, it was. Did you see our other hand? It had zero moxin in it. How are you going to keep a hand with zero moxin in it? Oh! Oh, no. Oh, no. What do I do? 
Yo, I gotta be casting the Oko here, right? Right? It's gotta be Oko Walk, right? It's gotta be Oko Walk. I'm not letting anyone talk me out of that one. It's, it's perfect. It's, I, we can't draft more of this. Oh, I was misled. I was, I was misled. <laughs> oh, I was misled, chat.